Hello everybody, everyone. So today <clears throat> we're going to be demonstrating a little video about makeup, how to apply it. So as you guys can see, I grabbed it, I applied it through my cheeks, through my eyes, not inside. Make sure you close them. <laughs> so then you blow it out, you know, you let it dry, you know, you think about all the good stuff. And then you fix your hair. You don't want to get it in your hair. You grab a little more lotion because it's dried up just a little bit. And then you spray this alcohol liquid. I don't know what it is. Oh, man. Make sure it's uh, pretty safe. You don't want anything to happen. So then you're going to get this brown stuff. Or if you're white or whatever color you are, you apply it in your cheeks. And then you have to make sure you grab that sponge and then you... Tap it, tap it, tap it, tap it, tap it until it's nice and spread and it matches your neck. You don't want to be looking out there all dummy with two different colors. Then you get that tr Trump looking style. You fix it because you want to apply it nice all over. And then you get this mascara. Or what is it? I don't know what it is. Anyway, let's keep on moving forward. So you grab a brush, then you apply it under the eyes. Nice and neatly, nice and neatly. You're going to look like a clown, but it's all right. The results at the end will be beautiful. Then you grab the sponge after the brush. And then you tap a tap a tap a little more. Tap a tap a tap a tap a. And then you grab this other liquid. You guys should know what I'm... You guys... You know, you guys get the point. So you guys grab a little more. Smear it all over. To the left. To the right. Down up and then in your chin in your chin 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 and in medio and the forehead too on top and this is a uh, I don't know what it's called but you guys can keep smearing it and then after get the sponge again to tap a tap a tap a under tap a tap a little bit under to the top to the bottom to the left to the right both sides you don't want to get it in your eye so be careful and then in the chin make sure you cover all them ugly spots if you're ugly if you're pretty don't worry about it just keep on tapping 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 up then the other side obviously see my face is starting to look different then you get some powder I don't know what kind of honey make sure those are not drugs you put in there oh man Then you tap a little more on the right. Then you tap a little more on the left. Depends what way you're looking at the screen. In the chin, 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 by your nose. Underneath your nose, your cheeks. Oh, okay, tap, tap, tap. Then you get some lip gloss. You smear it nice, beautiful on the top. On the bottom, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. you grab your brush and that other liquid, and then you you see how they're uneven. Don't worry about it; it's fine. It's part of the show. That's to level out the eyes. You see now everything looks level. Now you're gonna do your eye las cejas. You're gonna do them chola style, gringa style, Mexican style. Cholo style, whatever, whatever style you want to do, that's on you. Don't worry about it. Be happy. So that's the personal look, how you want to do them. Oh, man, I'm getting a little tired here. That's all right. Part of the show. Let's keep on working here. Looks beautiful. So you grab it and you smear it under the ceja. You grab your finger. You just want to clean it out nice and smooth. Then you grab your other sponge and you apply whatever color you're doing and you smear it nice and beautiful. You see? There you go. Looks very nice. It's starting to look like a chola. <laughs> ya después que te apliques bien el líquido, vamos a agarrar este cuadro de color blanco, café y negro, los, tus colores preferidos. Then you get this uh, 
fluffy sponge and put it over your eyes back and forth back and forth then you grab a little more you put it on the other one you do the same thing back and forth back and forth Keep applying it and smear it until it looks kind of like the same as the other side. If you're missing a little bit on one side, then you put a little more on the other side. You know, you get my drift. You get my drift. Well, that drug powder I put in my cheek still out there. I'll release it right now. So you apply a little more personal color, either pink, uh, purple. You know, you choose your color, whatever looks nice on you, whatever clothes you're wearing you know depends how how fashionista you are and want to look and you so then you get that bigger sponge the bigger one and you just keep going so I can smear it all nice it's gonna look beautiful elegant gorgeous oh man so you grab a little more personal color then you smear it a little more on top and blend it in you see now you guys have three different colors in there and you guys always want to just keep adding more if you guys want to look like payasas whatever you guys want to look you know you just keep adding more colors it depends what kind of look you're going for so you smear it a little more twice you cut it in half you see, looks nice and even. And then you get some white on top and you can keep them going green, red, you know, whatever. You can just keep escalating. Your forehead is if it's big, you can keep adding colors. Then you get the smaller one, then you get another personal color, whatever you want to do. You smear it a little more. Then you get that uh, fluffy sponge. Now we're gonna do the eyes. This is a little tricky right here. You see, it's kind of like a like a walk in the park for me now. But you know what? It can get tricky, especially when I'm doing it in the car and my husband's driving like a maniac. That's when it goes crazy. Ojito. Bonito. So then you want to apply that right in the lip of the eye. It's like, wow. You don't want to get it in the eye, just in the lip of the eye. So then you want to do the other side. This is a tricky. You got to, you have to make sure it looks the same. Then you get that big ass sponge and then you just smear everything just not in your eyes just then you get the mascara and you put it on your eyelashes to give it that Betty Boop looking so as you guys can see I'm trying to make my eyes a little bigger so you guys get a different color and just smear it in like I said every color you use that's personally whatever color you want to use so don't feel discriminated now if you want to add a little more texture to it you could grab some fake stuff People won't even notice it. Ha! <laughs> Just kidding. <laughs> so make sure you don't pinch your eyes. Uh, anyway, you get a little more drugs. I don't know what it is, to be honest. The dope is the dope on las tortillas. Agarras más. Color café. Y eso es para que te haga la cara más uh, 
Pues sepa como es bonita. Make your lows a little pointy. And then you're going to grab the base sponge, apply it on the left side, apply it on the right side. And this is to make your face a little more, more pointy, more sharp, and more smooth, more, more, more beautiful, shall I say. Fix your hair. Make sure you don't get none of that stuff in your hair. Especially after it's all done. Then you get that uh, fan looking sponge. Smear it on the left, smear it on the right. A little bit of wham. You see, then you don't need no filter. That's exactly what you need to do. What the filter does for you. That fan sponge. So you guys see the magic? So you guys want to put that finger so you guys don't get it and mess up your artwork and then you know at the same time it looks all nice so le das otra retocadita con el chiquito pa abajo you guys see how the puzzle is coming up together it's looking beautiful So you le das pa abajo, le das pa abajo, con mucho cuidado para no irte a manchar la cara. After, agarras poquita sal de la cocina. Ah no, es sal de the sea salt. You scrub it in your lips, get all that lip gloss again off, and then you grab a little more lip gloss to match your skin. Mm, beautiful. Es una manera de hacer tu propio colorete en otras palabras. Me agarras el lápiz, no el del niño. El del niño no. Y haces tu propio tu propio maquillaje. Sorry, it's a little blurry. So you grab a little more color and you kind of want to fix it so it looks the same on both sides. Y agarras poquito spray, that's just pa que te proteja el maquillaje, te lo secas, un chiflidillo. So, ya ven? Muy sencillo, muy fácil, very simple. All you have to do is follow my steps, one through 100, and everything will come out nice and neatly and smooth. Don't forget to like and subscribe. Love you guys. Good day.